debut tonight, a record runner, an Auburn senior, is, is inspiring others through a passion she found much later in life, and she's very good at it. At the National Senior Games this year, she scored second place in state sprinting. Casey Ray 3's Claire Duan spoke to Beth Stroh about what keeps her so active. <laughs> That's part of the game. You have to look nice. <laughs> Right? When 83 year old Beth Stowe put on her competitive shoes for the first time, isn't that neat? It was because she was running away from something. Well, my husband died six and a half years ago, and life changed, and I had to change with it. With those life changes came new uplifting experiences, including a road race. It was then the four foot nine, 90 pound redhead realized, along with being mentally sharp, arms, 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 punch, punch, punch. She's lightning fast. Kicks. When the announcer shot the gun off, I took off. And um, I left a lot of people in the dust. So I thought, oh, I can do this. This is okay. Age never crossed her mind as she embarked on this new path because. Most people are surprised. They think 80 is old, but I think it's 40. <laughs> 80 is the new 40. Yeah, that's right. It is. Go. And running the new bingo. The sprinting is something fast, and you get the high adrenaline to get going quicker. At the National Senior Games this year, it gives you a new project in life. Stro plays fifth in the nation for sprinting in her age category, but she's not competitive. I don't worry about that. I just worry about wh what I did the last time and can I do better. She hopes bettering herself in this way will encourage others to race toward their own goals. You don't have to be young to do it. You just have to put one foot in front of the other. In Auburn, Claire Duan, KCRA 3 News. She looks good, doesn't she? Yeah, I mean, she looks great. Yeah, I don't want her chasing me, though. For her 80th birthday, Stowe went skydiving. She wants to try whitewater rafting and pickleball. Just find out what this is. If you don't know, it's a fun sport that combines the elements of tennis, badminton, and ping pong. Good for her.